The leaves are changing already and it's, it's August. I mean, look at this. What? Hi everybody, thank you so much for tuning back into my channel and if you're new, my name's Ashley and my plan is I am going to Macy's because they're running a deal that if you spend a certain amount of money you get like this free like sample pack of a bunch of Estee Lauder stuff and Estee Lauder is like my favorite brand for makeup so I'm super excited to try all the new samples, I'll probably make a video of that and then afterwards I am going to get a piercing and I am super super excited because I've been wanting this piercing for a while. I'm planning on getting the conch piercing on my left ear. So um, I have, I think I have six piercings right now. Yeah, I have six piercings. I have two on each earlobe. I have my helix and I have my belly button pierced. And I used to have my nose pierced, but then I took it out because there was like a bump forming and I was like, ah, it's infected, I'm nervous, I'm scared. So I like took it out and then I like looked it up online and I found out that with cartilage piercings, bumps are really common and they eventually go away. So I took that piercing out for nothing and I'm really upset because I absolutely loved my nose piercing. I had it for like a month and then I was like freaking out. Um, piercing place that I'm going to, they don't allow videotaping inside like during the piercing. So I won't be able to film myself actually getting it, but I'll show you the aftermath and all that stuff and how I'm feeling and if the pain was bad. I don't think it should be any worse than my helix. My helix wasn't even that bad. Like it was just like a quick pop and my ear was like throbby for a little while. But other than that, it wasn't bad. So I'm thinking the conch probably won't be any worse. I mean, it is a little thicker of the cartilage down in that area, but I guess we'll find out. So anyway, if you want to see how my piercing turns out, keep on watching. To get the double wear foundation in the shade one and two. One and two. Yes. Right? Yes. yes. Oh yeah, we have it. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> Anything else? Um, no, just that. Okay. All right, so I got my makeup. Um, which I will show you that one and two ecru. So yay me. Also got a free gift. So I got this cute little makeup bag. It says Estee Lauder on the top. It's really cute. And there's some stuff inside. So cute, there's stickers. Let's see, it's like Christmas day. Oh, it's like a, it's like a um, tutorial on how to apply the makeup that they gave us. All right, so I've got, oh cute, an Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair. So there's that, it's like a little sample bottle. I don't really know what it is. It's probably like a facial serum or something. I'll read more into it. Then I got Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Synchronized Complex 2. So there's that one. They kind of look the same. They might be the same thing, maybe just a different type of, wait. Let me read the special tutorial card. You use it on your face and throat, AM and PM. And then the advanced night repair, intense reset concentrate after you put the other one on. So you do them both at the same time, apparently. That seems like a lot of serum to me, but we'll see. Then we also got a advanced night repair eye in a cute little container. That must go under the eyes. Lady just walked by, she's watching me film. Ooh, that smells good. Ooh, that's cute. It's a pretty like, see that? That's pretty. Ooh, what's this? I got 
had a lot of stuff. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Look at the packaging. That's so pretty. It's a moon and stars. <gasps> Ooh, those are pretty colors. It's an eyeshadow palette, everybody. And you know how much I love my eyeshadow. And it's purple hue, so it's gonna be perfect for my eyes. Pretty, look at that. Oh my goodness, my lap is complete. Sumptuous Extreme Lash Multiplying Volume Mascara. You know what, I've tried this stuff before and I really did like it. It's no different than normal mascara, like drugstore brand mascara in my opinion, but it is good, I do like it, so I'll take it. I mean, free stuff, man, I'll use it. So there's the packaging on that. Last but not least, I got a Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay In Place Eye Pencil in the shade Coffee. That's cute. I love eye pencils. And it says, to coffee. Sweet! So I'm excited to try all this stuff. Wow, that's a, that's a good free gift, man. I thought they were just going to give you like... A sample of like mascara but no it's like an actual like whole face thing I'm excited and I even got stickers I love stickers and this bag it's so cute ah I'm excited thank you Estee Lauder please sponsor me <laughs> all right so next up is my piercing woo baby so cute hi honey so I'm back. I just got my piercing. I don't know if you can see it. Wait, let me put it in. There it is. Look at that. So I won't be able to have like a fitted one until it heals. And as you can tell, it's red. So I am absolutely in love with this. It didn't hurt more than Helix. I mean, it kind of did. It was definitely a more of a, like, puncture. I could, like, feel the difference. But it really wasn't that bad. And, like, honestly, it hurts less afterwards than the Helix did afterwards, if you know what I'm saying. So, she told me I have to clean it twice a day with saline solution, which is what I've been doing with my Helix anyway. And she said not to sleep on that side, which is what I've been doing anyway with my Helix. And, um... Sorry about my weird bun. I just had to put my hair up when I was in there. So I just like threw it up in this weird bun real quick. But anyway, I want you guys to look at that. Oh, I love it. I am so obsessed with it. Eee! So um, she gave me, oh, I also got this cute little sticker. I got my piercing at Grim North and I didn't cry. That's so cute. I have like five of these, <laughs> but I put them on my computer. And then she gave me a piercing aftercare. And like she wrote on the back how long that I have to wait. Um, so, and then it tells you what, all about it and lets you know that if you see anything weird, make sure you call your doctor or something um, or even call them. But I would definitely recommend this place for piercings because um, Grim North, Grim North in downtown Portsmouth. And I would personally recommend this place because one, it's super clean and the atmosphere inside is so different. You know, there's like, like the curtains have like cats on them and the the couches are like vintage looking there's pictures on the wall and everyone there is so nice and so i would definitely recommend this place and i their piercings start at 40 dollars, and then you have to pay for the um the jewelry itself so my conch piercing was 65 dollars altogether, and then of course a tip make sure you tip your piercers everybody um so I'm in love with it and I'm so happy. And I asked her, I honestly asked her today, I was like, what is your favorite piercing to do? And she said, honestly, conch is one of my favorites and I feel like more people need to do it. And I was like, well, today's your lucky day. That's what I'm doing. So um, what I would love to do sometime is go into a piercing shop and be like, okay, I don't know what I want. 
you do whatever you want to me and then they pierce you wherever they want to pierce you but then i'd be afraid i'd get a tongue piercing but i don't want a tongue piercing you know i'd be afraid to get like an eyebrow you know i don't want like face i want a nose again but that's another thing that i would be afraid of they'd be like okay fine and it's like no i don't want my tongue pierced but anyway so today has been quite the adventure and i'm so excited about my helix pierce helix conch piercing it, it is starting to throb. And I'm sure it's red. But. I can't back out of this parking spot because there's a male driver guy parked behind me. Oh, they're leaving. Bye. I'm eating vanilla wafers. So anyway, I have to go to the store and get some saline solution um, to clean my ear with. And then I have to go to work. And yeah, so I think that's the end of my video. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. and I hope you enjoyed my piercing adventure video. And I'm sure there's going to be a bunch more because I want to get a bunch more piercings. So yeah, thanks for tuning in. I hope you like, subscribe, and comment on what piercing... Oh, what piercing should I get next? Comment what piercing I should get next because I know what I want next, but I'm not going to say it. So whoever gets it right, I will be so proud of you. So anyway, thank you so much for watching and I hope that you'll tune into my next video and yeah, have a great day.